Hey, Ben Watts Store Fitness, and starting on August 2nd, we're gonna be starting a new phase in the protocol, new cycle. So this is our sports foundation phase number one, implying that there will be a phase number two to come. So this is our first sports foundation phase. It's gonna take us through the remainder of the summer. And um, first of all, what that means is that if you're someone who's been craving a little bit more of Metcons and intervals and things that are a little bit more CrossFit-like, like you're gonna start getting a little bit more of that. So reason being, we're getting into the fall or starting to prep for the fall. And oftentimes this is sort of qualifier season. There's a lot of um, other comps that are going on besides just like the CrossFit open season or the CrossFit game season that takes us through the spring. So that being said, this prepares everyone to do if they wanna do a partner comp or if they wanna do a local comp or anything like that, this allows them to start to prepare for that. But also we're not going all the way into comp prep where it's super stressful and trying to put all of our stress into that bucket. Um, this allows us to diversify just a little bit more and still get some of our touches that we need to um, on the strength, on some of the skills that we need. So that being said, one thing that you're gonna notice, we're gonna keep the same like weekly format and like that being Thursday is the recovery day, Sunday's a rest day. But for Saturday, the name game is back. So that's one big change. We're changing from the mash to the name game. So volume is gonna come down and intensity will go up as a result, right? So if you do less total work because you're only doing one piece, that means that the intensity of that work or the density of that work could be higher. So the name game, it's back. Um, I'll be doing video announcements for that. So yeah, it's another way for us to start to prep for qualifier seasons and to get ready to actually test workouts like that in that style. Um, we're gonna be doing plenty of Oli lifting, touches on snatch and clean jerk, um, as well as squatting movements as a whole. So we'll make sure we're front, overhead, and back squatting on a bi-weekly basis for sure. Um, every Friday we'll be doing back squats and then alternating Monday, we'll be doing front or overhead squats. Um, obviously we can get other touches of that in intervals or mat cons, but in terms of strength work, dedicated strength work, that's what we're talking about. Also, we're gonna start doing some battery work in um, sort of an interval format. So this could be um, snatch or clean jerk variations, and we're making sure that we're doing something to get us breathing a little bit harder, and then we're gonna hit several reps of that movement. Um, for example, Monday we'll be doing some, often it'll be like snatch battery work, or maybe it'll be a squat clean um, battery work, where maybe it's a incremental row at an increasing pace, and then you have a short rest period, and then you're hitting maybe five clusters of snatches or something, right? You rest, you repeat, and that's sort of what we're talking about. So it's strength work, but it's not traditional. It's starting to look a little bit more like the sport, hence sports foundations. So Tuesday, it's gonna still be, we'll still be doing some like Metcons and breathing, and we'll actually be doing a lot more conditioning on that day. But a big focus early in that session is going to be with gymnastics. We're gonna be doing some strict gymnastics or pressing and pulling work on that day. Wednesday, we're gonna be doing a lot more um, weightlifting work, specifically like snatch or cleaning jerk. And again, um, here we'll either be doing one as sort of the main lift and another as like more of an alternative accessory type style lift. So for example, if we snatch heavy, maybe we do lighter power clean and push presses or something like that as a secondary thing. Also on that day, we're gonna be doing some desaturation energy systems training. So what that means, desaturation, basically you're taking your oxygen level and you're bringing it down to a very low level and then you're resting and letting that sort of like recharge and then you'll hit that again, right? So basically you can think of it as sprint work. So you'll be hitting something really hard, you'll have a rest period and it's not gonna be, able, it's not gonna feel like a long rest period and then you'll come back and hit that again. So desaturation, that will either be on the air bike or rower, because those are the two ergs that I make sure everybody has when they're doing this program. And then Friday, as I mentioned already, we're, we'll be back squatting, but then we'll doing some interval work after that, and also some more cyclical accumulation. So basically just getting the aerobic system really ready to go and getting some additional volume that really helps with cardiac output and some of the physiological qualities that we need for the sport. And then, as I mentioned, Saturday is the name game. So that's sort of the over-encompassing idea of this cycle. Um, you've got the weekly outline. Yeah, feel free to let me know if you got questions. If you're someone who's not signed up, make sure you, 
yeah, get a free week. Go to zoomerfitness.com slash pro dash trial to get a free week of the protocol. That'll also get you into all the pro articles. Um, and if you actually pay for it, you'll get the vault, which is every program I've ever written. So be sure to check it out. Let me know if you have questions. Best of luck. See you in Sport Foundations phase number one.